For the sake of the game, should you not resign, Mr Blacker? He may have seemed embattled to the outside world, but within FIFA, Sepp Blatter seems secure. And that was spelt out, in case anyone was wondering. At times, he appeared emotional as he fought to continue his presidency. I am being held accountable for the current storm. Well, OK. So be it. I will shoulder that responsibility. I will take it. Just as I said earlier today, I will shoulder it, I will take it upon myself. Applause from the delegates, but why are so many still supporting him? Well, they're mostly from Africa and Asia, and they feel they've had far fairer treatment during the Sepp Blatter years. We go for negative and positive point. I think still he's the, having the majority of positive point. Stability. For this house is very important. For many, though, stability is the last thing Sepp Blatter represents. And you have to ask yourself, who can provide the leadership to take this organisation forward? And I think it's unthinkable to believe that Sepp Blatter can be the person to take that organisation forward. And that is why change is needed. And the faster that change comes, I think the more people can have clarity about what needs to happen next. The challenger, Prince Ali of Jordan. Unsurprisingly, his theme was also responsibility. I will not hide among your ranks when things are bad, stepping forward when things are good. If you give me the honour of your vote, I will take full responsibility and hold myself accountable to all of you and to the world. In the end, polite applause suggested he hadn't done enough. But maybe this isn't the end particularly if prosecutors in the United States unearth any more evidence.